welcome to a magical cocktail adventure where it's all about making cocktails at home or wherever your home is and having some fun. I am Helen and today we are so excited. We're on location with our wonderful mum and dad's motorhome and this is her last journey for mum and dad. They've been traveling around Australia for 20 years and today is the last time so we're honoring mum and dad's journeys and the beautiful motorhome with this fantastic cocktail tin tins cocktail and i found this recipe in a fantastic book lady penelope's cocktails so yes it's all about thunderbirds as well today now our tin tin cocktail has a few ingredients we're going to use fresh blueberries, fresh limes, fresh strawberries and some mango and also some vodka and some raspberry liqueur. Now, the recipe does say a raspberry vodka, but cocktails are all about making use of what you do have at home. And what I have at home is some normal vodka and some raspberry liqueur so i thought well i can combine that or you could use a raspberry cordial as well it's it's totally up to you and all we're going to do today is use the boston shaker and get the shaker out and we're going to place all the fruit into the base of the shaker so we want four blueberries one two three four two wedges of lime one Two, two strawberries in that goes like that and then a slice of mango I'm using a mango slice the recipe does say a dash of mango mango puree so I reckon it'll be just perfect and I'm going to muddle these together if once again you don't have a muddler I have this wooden muddler if at home you can use a wooden spoon and all we're going to do is just smash these together and we're going to infuse all those juices and flavors together. We're going to get right down there to the blueberries. Look at that. Looking great. A great muddle. So let's muddle this up by the cup. <laughs> oh boy. There we go. That's a great muddle. I think I've got the blueberries there the lime all infusing together really beautiful so that's that then we're going to place some ice in as well a couple of places of ice goes in you can hear all the birds going off we have kookaburras we have cockatoos it's all happening here in our beautiful park and we want 30 ml of vodka goes in which is one ounce goes there and I'm going to put one ounce of the raspberry liqueur in as well and I found this liqueur I found at Castle Glen distillery they have a distillery in Stanthorpe in Queensland and they are beautiful products so that goes in and all we do now is place on our lid give it a mash and shake it up. Let's shake it up, Buttercup. Let's shake this up, Buttercup. All right, that's gorgeous. The glass today we will use is a martini glass. And we're going to double strain this. I think a double strain will be good. But I'm gonna call my sister up to help me because I don't have three hands. Robbie, she doesn't know I've called her up. <laughs> I need you to hold that there. Thank you. I haven't worked out how to double strain with two hands. There, oh, look at the color Yum. of that. Right, so now what we're going to do, thanks Robbie, hold that there. I am. And we're just going to do a bit of this action. Now Robbie can stay because she can do a taste test as well. <laughs> now you can put ice in your drink here if you like or not. It's up to you. And our garnish, I've gone fresh once again. 
and a beautiful fresh skewer of blueberries and strawberry place on top and let's put a couple of pieces of ice in because officially our spring is happening some ice goes in and voila there we have Tintin's cocktail take yeah. it away Robbie give it a taste test Helen's favorite part <laughs> Oh, that is so nice. Okay, my turn yeah. now. Oh, the lime. Thank Yum. You. Oh, wow. You know, <laughs> I'm not wrong, am I, darling? That is fabulous. <laughs> Thanks, Robbie. Mmm. <laughs> you know what, guys? That is really delicious. And, Dad, I'd love you to come up and taste test this cocktail as well. Come on up, Dad. Go on, Dad. Dad and Mum don't really drink, so this is a, even an even bigger occasion for Mum and Dad to maybe sip on one of my cocktails. Come on, Dad, you can do it. <laughs> Here you go. You want a taste of the cocktail? Right. Mmm, <laughs> beautiful. Like that? Beautiful. You like that? Yes, very nice. Oh, excellent. Love you, Dad. I love you for. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> and we've done 500,000 kilometres. Oh, how long have you done? How many? 500,000. 500,000 kilometres they've done in the last 20 years. That's just incredible. I love you, Mum. Love you, Dad. Thank you so much for watching today. We're going to celebrate the end of the beautiful motorhome. We love our mum and dad. I'd like to say a big thank you to my mum and dad, who I love very much. I'm so proud of them. 88 and 86, and they're now finishing their journey around Australia. That's it from me. If you have enjoyed our wonderful location, our fabulous cocktail, please give me a thumbs up, and why not press that subscribe button and share with your friends. And if you do subscribe, you get more notifications of when we have another cocktail. We've done two taste tests today and it seems like everyone is loving the cocktail. So thank you so much for watching. I am Helen, the cocktail queen of Mount Tambourine. Thank you so much. I'll see you in a few weeks time for another fabulous cocktail. Mm. Cheers. Thank you. Yeah. Mm. It's absolutely outstandingly delicious. wonderful cocktail adventure where it's all about the recipe does say strawberry vodka actually no the recipe does say raspberry vodka uh oh mum crack it up what do you crack did you fart did mum fart <laughs>